Pasta Robles, wine is part of living, with tasting rooms and classic blends around every corner. But at Cass Vineyard and Winery, their 145 acre vineyard offers exclusive blends only really found in France itself. And with a reputation like that, a wine gal like me can't wait to get a try. Cass, you brought me into your library and I was expecting something a little bit different from mm -hmm. that. Now, how long has Cass Wines been around? We've been open 13 years uh, this weekend, actually. Now, tell me about the Cass story. My wife and I came down here thinking about a second home, like a vacation home. We saw vineyards and wineries everywhere. We fell in mm -hmm. love with Paso Robles. Uh -huh. And the whole idea changed in one day. We're not just looking for a vacation home. This is the second career that I've been thinking about doing for a long time now, and I just never knew what to do. What type of experience do people get when they come here? We try to give them a, a more robust experience than just tasting wine. We have a full-fledged kitchen with a really nice lunch menu, and we, we invite people to sit on the veranda and uh, taste the wines on the veranda overlooking the vineyard while they're having a little bit to eat. Wine is great as a cocktail, but it's even better with food. So what we're gonna start with is our 2017 Roussan. Stainless steel, very cold fermented, so that's why it's so aromatic and all really fruity. Totally dry, but really fruity. So we'll move on to the rosé. With this, I pick it specifically to make rosé. Mm -hmm. So it's not necessarily cost effective, but it makes a great wine. Our walking red. This is aged in primarily French oak uh, for nearly two years. And then we hold on to it in bottle for another year after that, even before we release it. This is a Cabernet Sauvignon. Mm -hmm. I kind of refer to it sometimes as an old world style, but with this fresh California fruit. Roll hills, coastal atmosphere, and incredible wines, Cass Winery is the perfect place to be to enjoy the views with a glass or two. 